All right, hi everybody, it's Bonkai922. This is gonna be a very, very quick Blade review. Um, chapter 570, Closer, Closer. Now, this, this chapter wasn't a lot. There wasn't really anything going on in this chapter. All it really was was the conclusion to Rukia's fight with Asnot, with her Bonkai. And we see a big thing in the beginning with him in a bed. And Know, he's thinking about death, you know, like when die, go to heaven or hell, you know. And he's afraid, and that was short lived. Um, and we see Bayaki is with her, with Rukia, and he tells her to take it slow, don't rush, um, getting out of your bankai. And she's, he basically says it's a min, 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 it's a um, unbelievable bankai. Um, but it's also a merciless, not merciless Bankai. I mean, it will kill her if she doesn't be very careful with it. And pretty much, that ends the whole thing with Asnot. And then after that, we just had this thing with, with Yachiru and Asane. So that's where we're going after this. And they encounter Sternritter V. Very intriguing, um, and pretty much, you know, basically, it is a short conversation with Izane and uh, Yachiru, and apparently they, um, Yachiru went to get, like, mats or mattresses and shit, and they're there, and she brings them back and saying, oh, Kenchan is doing something else, and, you know, she's just there. And what ends up happening is, we get to, we see him, the Sturm Reader. Um, she, she says something to Achiru, Ch and she, what happens, I believe, is the guy says something to her, but you don't see him until the very end, and he says, I see you, I see you, I see you, and then out of nowhere, Achiru punches him, but then Achiru gets slapped, and, you know, that's pretty much what happens, and then, you know, he basically explained, I'm the Stern Ritter V vanishing point. Now, knowing by the letters, going by the letters of the Stern Ritters, he's V. I mean, can't be that immensely powerful. Now, mind you, he is fighting, now, Asane and Yachu are fighting him. Like, these are the two people who we've seen squat from. And that's what I meant when I said it's this chapter. There's really nothing happened in this chapter. It was very okay. It wasn't great. Um, we just got introduced to a new fight. And we just finished off a previous fight. So that's pretty much what went down in this chapter. Now, I will say Rukia in her Bankai form. Pretty badass. Pretty badass. And some I feel people, I think I'm like my... my uh, Live stream was saying this. Kind of, one person said, kind of looks like, um, her Zambakto form. Sere Sirayuki. That looks exactly like her. So, that was kind of interesting. But other than that, really nothing happened in this chapter. But overall, gonna give this a three and a half out of five. But I will say this. Going forward, this is very intriguing. These two Soul Reapers have done, as far as fights are concerned, nothing. Okay, first of all, you got Asane. Has Asane in the history of Bleach fought anyone? Not that I know of. But then again, she was lieutenant to Unaha, so. Yeah. And then, of course, you got Yichiro. Yichiro hasn't even. She fought, she hasn't even unsheathed her Shikai. Forget Bankai. She's never fought anyone at all. So this is a very intriguing setup, if anything. So I'm hoping next week Kubo really throws it out there with this setup for this fight. Because, I mean, unless by some miracle Zaraki shows up out of nowhere... And he ends up fighting this guy then, okay? But I don't think so. These these two are like 
as far as lieutenants are concerned, if you really think about this, Rookie's got a Bonkai, Ranji's got a Bonkai, and you got the other lieutenants here and there. But, like, they're, like, probably the one only lieutenants that really fight anyone. Or one of them that just really low tier. I mean, you really go about it, lieutenants. You got Shuhei. You know, Shuhei's four punch people. Um, Kira, who I'm guessing is dead by it right now. And you got Matsumoto. But these two, they haven't fought anyone. These two Soul Reapers. These two lieutenants. And I would really love it to see Yachiro fight this one. Yachiro or Sonic. Either way, good with this fight. This fight is very, in my opinion, I'm looking forward to it. I really am. Hopefully Kubo brings up brings a better chapter next week and really shows this fight in full effect. Because I, I really don't want to have to be like, you know, fucking, uh, you know, freaking um, somebody comes to help them. I'm like, no. Let's have them fight this guy. This vanishing point. Yeah, he can't be that tough. Oh, he's... You don't see me. Yeah, but you're the letter V guy. You can't be that powerful compared to the other Stern Ridders. Come on. But we'll see for next week. But I really like this. Now, like I said, chapter as a whole, it really was just okay. And like I said, but... For going forward, this is a good setup. I like the setup. I really do. I love this setup. Because this is really what she'd be, Kubo should be doing. He should be getting people in these fights who we've never seen fought ever. You're talking ever. I don't think not a single time while watching the Bleach anime has Yachiru fought anyone? Actually, well, there was one time. But you know when that was? Filler. And she wasn't fighting anyone. She didn't do anything. I I think if Yachiru fights this guy, awesome. If Yasane fights him, still pretty awesome. Because then again, you know, okay. When was the last time Sonic fought? Beginning Soul Reaper arc? The, 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 the Soul Society arc? Where she got... Baiji? So, yeah. This really go. It would be interesting to see if, like, maybe... Or maybe, like, what happens is... Um... <clears throat> Sane helps Ichiru by telling her where this guy is. And Ichiru and she, you know, and she fights... It, it, it's something to think about because I, I really, you know, this is the time when you say to yourself, yeah, yeah, Chiro's going to fight somebody. Defeat him. And that's going to be awesome. But yeah, that's pretty much the story, people. Like I said, nothing much of this. The chapters this week weren't really, they weren't up to speed. I, I think that's the big time, um conception throughout the community for this week. Bleach? I mean, you know, that was... And this was, wasn't any better because all it really was was, oh, you get to see Rukia in her bottom platform. You know, that's it? Besides that, what do you have? This introduction, this, this new fight. But nothing really happened. So it was, it was an okay chapter. But... For next week, it sets it up nicely. I will say that. Give it a three and a half out of five. But sets it up nice to eat. Sets it up very nicely for next week. So, yeah, good stuff going on there. Um, later today, probably do this won't be uploaded right now. I'll upload it later today. Um, this bleach chapter review. Later today, also, I will do. Um, I'm trying to think. Oh, Toriko. Toriko. I'm going to get that on that Toriko. Um, besides that, it's probably just going to be the same Bear Bells and Whistles. Which is probably going to be... Um, I'm going to try to do... Um, uh, one piece i got to do. 
So it's Toriko, One Piece, and probably... I'm thinking of doing a... Um, whatchamacallit? Times of Darkness stream. Um, don't know if I can, but I'll try. Um, pull it together. It's kind of hard, because, uh, you know, you don't know where the members are doing. I mean, I could bring in hockey, probably, and Shot Red, and AGN. Because we haven't done one in a while. In a long ass while, so I think it's time to do one. So we'll see. But until then, it's Bonkai Night 22. I will see you guys later. Yeah, this week's Big Three. And One Piece, too. One Piece was, from what I understand, a lot of people didn't like it. They said it sucked. I'm like, whoa. That was the conception. I was like, damn, that was a big surprise for this week. Lackluster of chapters. But then again, when you really think about it, Maggie, the Seven Deadly Sins, those two are those two are far. I, you, you listen, man. I, you, you really think about it, Maggie and the Seven Deadly Sins. Those two mangas, each week they come out with stellar chapters, just like wow, what else can happen in Maggie? What else can happen in Seven Deadly Sins? You look forward to it. If anything, all the chapters come out, they reveal. Those are the two that I look forward to the most. That's a fact. So yeah, you know, I'm Bonkai922. See you guys later. Hey, there's always next week. There's always next week. See you guys later. Peace.